Thank you all for joining me and welcome back to Icarus. Oh, I've done it again with my lantern. Right, okay. Because I don't always use the lantern when, uh, like, on my own. It's only when I'm actually recording videos because uh, most of the time it's fine for me. But obviously for you guys, you want to be able to see it a bit better. So that's why I do it that way. Uh, so we are going to be doing some more work uh, on the building side of things. I, I've not seen your comments about this yet. So because obviously I'm doing back-to-back -back videos. And... Um, so I don't know how this works. I feel like it's not been implemented properly. I think it's the, the kind of like getting ready for uh, the Prometheus expansion with the, what's it called? Uh, the North Sector. Uh, so but it's a bit strange that they've added it and not actually implemented it properly. That's my guess. I might be wrong on that. Maybe there is a way of doing it. I don't know. Um, so I'll have to look into it. So... Uh, I'm just waiting for these walls here. We might need some more stone, in fact. Uh, let me just drop those off in there a minute. Uh, we might need some more brick stone. I've got another 400 coming through there uh, because we're going to be doing some flooring. Because I, what, what I want to do, I want to get... Uh, let me just go up with these. I want to get it set up so that we can actually get the everything moved up here and use it. The only downside we might have is basically this up here looks like a school yeah look at that that is so dangerous that, that now that's disappeared that would not uh because there's a lot of support there so that would not have happened and this is all stayed up so that's actually good <laughs> uh, so that's really really good so what i'm going to do we're going to go ahead and we're going to use these walls here to actually go here a lot so if we just go here a lot and to go round Okay, because these are not going to be too high. This is going to be too high, but that inside there is not going to be too high. I've just got to be careful. I don't go off there. I'm going to need to get some extra stuff done for that on now. So we want that there. We want that there. There we go. There we go. Okay, because we kind of only need this access here. Uh, I need to work out how I'm going to do that access. I might do it similar to what I did on the base that was actually at the um, in the Riverlands, so the forest, um, where we actually do like the, the the interior wood thing. I don't know yet. I've decided. Or I might do something slightly different. So that's why I wanted to get this done. But we're going to need 64, I think, of the flooring because we're going to do brick flooring. Be careful I don't stand there. We are going to do the brick flooring. There we go. Okay, so that's that sorted. That actually looks uh, pretty nice there. And obviously, we need to do some kind of access there. And then we just need to do some flooring in here. I'm not going to put the stairs in just yet. I just want to sort of uh, get this sorted so we can actually move on from here and get things moving. And uh, we are, I think, I was going to put some stairs coming up here up to there but do we really really need to we're going to have four ways of accessing it so we're going to go up to here and then up to there so we could do it that way um that's something we'll look into later on so let's go ahead and uh, see how far we've got with the crafting yeah so at the moment i'm like kind of like doubling up on uh, recordings at the moment because uh, my son's going back to school next week I, I think i'm going to do some golfing and that i'm going to do a few things before he goes back just you know he's been bored for the last week or so and just get a few uh, do a few things before he goes back i mean we've done quite a lot with him but not as much as we usually does because I, I i took him away to blackpool for a few days he absolutely loved it um yeah and it, kind of, it was a good good weather actually to be honest uh so let's have a look at this then uh, let's see how many of these we can make. We can make one. <laughs> so I think we need 64, if I'm not mistaken. So if we look at how much we're going to need, yeah, we are going to... Well, obviously, we've got some more bricks coming in there. Is that enough? I do not know. Uh, we are going to need, what, 300, just over 300. Uh, we're going to need 300 screws. We are going to need 300 of that. Right, okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to grab that and we're going to go and get some 
In fact, before we do that, let's go ahead and put that on to charge. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me, I do apologize. So we're gonna go ahead and get some of those, get some, because we've, uh, we've kind of run out of those now, so I need to start working on that later on and getting that all back up. Uh, we need 300 screws. Have we actually got screws? Have we got 300? No, we've actually got 300. That's always nice to have, to, to actually not having to craft any up there. Um, and we need 300 of these, don't we? I think, or just over 300. I'm not mistaken. Just wait for this one. I think we might have enough here. There we go. And we're also going to need some of this as well. Okay. And we uh, should be kind of good there, I guess. Let's see. So we've got 55 there. We need to get to 64, of course. So we'll do the 55 to start with, and then we'll see how far we've got then. We might have to go out and get some more stone. So we'll do the 55 there. And, uh, and then we'll go from there. So, yeah. So we're just going to have to wait for this to finish. At the moment, we can do one. So I think we need 64. But plus, I'm going to need an extra one anyway. Uh, because we're going to need that for that floor that's disappeared. Now, that could have got damaged, actually. Because these do, do, do actually take damage. It's not like the concrete ones that don't actually take damage at all on... on on anything i mean if you look at these they're, they're not really taking any damage at all let's hope none of the floor in here is i don't want to fall down this one's okay uh I, I i might extend this down here as well and bring this out here so we've got this going all the way around kind of like that idea and we'll probably get some benches and stuff like that down here and stuff and i'll probably get some flowers going along the front or something like that and i think that'll look really really nice uh, I haven't. I still haven't put the door on here yet, but we will do. Uh, we should be okay for now. I really would like to know how to work that. I've got a funny feeling they haven't implemented it properly yet. Uh, it's, it's a bit strange thing to add and then not implement it. Because um, all that's going to do is just frustrate the player base. But uh, it could be just that I've just can't. I've not worked it out. Hopefully, someone actually actually has worked it out. And I'm just realised something. I'm going to need some. Yeah, we're going to need some stuff here. Okay. Have I actually got my... Yeah, I have. Good. Uh, going to need some coffee beans. I have coffee stuff. I'm just going to do it all. And then we'll just pull it in. And let it go again. Just look at how much we're getting from this. Getting quite a lot from there, so when we need 40 each time for what we're using it for, at least anyway. Let's go ahead and sort that out. Uh, I need to sort a window out for that as well. I need to eat as well, but while we're waiting, we can uh, sort that out real quick. And then we can get completely get rid of this then and move everything up. And I could probably get some stone on that from this as well. In fact, I could. Oh yeah, we've got to empty that yet, haven't we? Uh, okay, so... We need to put that in here. And as you can see there, we've got loads of this now. Uh, let me just put that front there. I want to use that first. Okay, and what I like to do is I like to... Just put that... Where is it? Where is it? Oh, there. I like to put that in there, mainly because it's just out of the way, because sometimes it will just drag that over, and I don't want that one to be done. So we need to put some water in there, of course. So we'll go ahead and do that, and I'll just leave that one in there until I've finished, and then we can come in here, and we can go ahead and sort that out. Because if I add that other bottle, it, it drags both bottles over for some reason. Um, It's a bit of a strange one, that is, but it is what it is, I guess. And uh, we've also got the, for the um, for the oxygen, uh, we've got the thing in the basement at the top there. So we don't need uh, oxide anymore. It's all connected through water and power and we can just chuck it in there and we're all good. Okay, so we're doing okay. I'm just waiting on this. 
We should be good. But look at how much we got from there. That's going to last me quite a while uh, before I need any more. And it would have been, it would have grown probably two times by the time I, uh, quite a lot actually by the time I'd finished using all this. Unless I was using something else, using it for something else. There we go. So we can grab that now. And I can grab that. That's actually for the mower, uh, for the actual animals. Uh, I need to eat as well. But I do want to get this upstairs. Uh, shall we have that? Dude, why are the stats not that good on that? It's, uh, I've did mess something up with the game or something. I don't know. Feels a bit bizarre. I'm not getting the stats. Look at that. Why am I not getting the stats? I used to get loads of... I mean, my health bar is good. But I used to get quite a lot of... Um, unless I've got the wrong... Um, I used to get quite a lot of stamina. But for some reason, I'm not getting that anymore. I mean, it doesn't matter. I suppose it doesn't matter too much because we're using the mirror all the time. But if I'm going to be on Prometheus, which I will be soon, uh, once those missions have been added, then I'm going to need that stamina because we're not going to be able to use the mower uh, for all, all of that. Right, out. Right, I'm doing another five, so that's 60. Let's get that done. And I think next video, what we can do is we can start sort of moving things over. So we've got the 60 there. Yeah, and I'm going to need some more brick. I think we need one, two, three, four. We're going to need five, aren't we? So I'm going to need, what, 100. So I'm going to need 300 stone. So I'm going to have to go out and get that stone. That's fine. Let's start off by just sorting this out. Have we actually got any stone at all? I've got a little bit of stone there, but not much. <sighs> do you know what? Let's just do it. I wasn't going to. I was going to save those a little bit, but there we go. We can get another 100 stone there. That should give us enough for everything we need. Okay, let's go ahead and start placing this flooring down then. And get everything set up. And they're ready for the next one. The next video. Which we can you know, sort things out. Okay, so let's go ahead and place that. replace that before I end up falling through it. <laughs> okay, I want to try and put them the right way, though. So we've got the arrow facing that way, away from us. There we go. That's all of that done there, and then we'll do the same over here. And then later on, we'll sort out the stairs and stuff like that of how we're going to do it. Obviously, we've got the new stairs with the corner ones and the half ones. Why am I stuck? Looking a bit red, but sometimes it does that and then it will go green. So if we look over here, it's still red, but we'll check over on the other side actually, because it'll be the same on it. So that's all green now, isn't it? So I want to do the same on here. One thing we didn't do is that beam there, but I can sort that out after, it's not a big deal. Oh, uh, oh, did that go in? Uh, I thought I'd messed up there. So that's that one done. Bloody storming now, of course. That's new. So far, so good with this. Um, the, the, sometimes you can get issues and stuff like that, but it looks like everything's fine. We need five more, I think. Do we need five more? Four, five. Yeah, we do need five more. I'm just going to pause it here because we've got the storm and the frames have dropped as usual, but that's actually going to help us out with the snow and everything. And this should give us the good cover to be able to actually start setting up the kitchen and that and getting all the power sorted out, getting everything up here and sorted. Uh, obviously, the power's going to come up from the basement because that's where everything is. Oh, I do apologise. 
I'm just trying to get comfy again, but I will be, I'll be back in a second. The storm's almost over. Um, I'm just waiting for it now because um, obviously the frames drop quite substantially, uh, quite a lot, to be honest with you, when there's a storm, especially with the big ones like this. The frames are going back up now and it's just horrible viewing for you guys. So uh, I always have to pause it for that. So it looks like we're good now. So we can go ahead. I've got the five that we need. Uh, so we can go ahead and finish that flooring. And then we're going to have a look at doing the... Um, I'm just hoping this actually holds. If this, this floor holds, I mean, I could lock out and lock back in, I guess, every time we've got a storm um, to stop it from, you know, falling through. Uh, where did we get to? We just covered that up. Yeah, this one, because you can see where the snow is. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and just hope that this goes okay. So we've got one there, one there. Making sure those arrows are all the way. I don't think it makes too much difference with this flooring. I mean, it will do, actually, because if you look at there, you've got that diagonal line there as well. So there we go. So that's all set up now. So we can actually start looking at the power and start working on the getting the power up here and how we're going to do that and where it's going to go. We might have to get beams going across the bottom there just to hide it. We'll just have to see how that goes. Uh, to see how i want to do it now let's start off with the normal power uh cable so let's have a look so if we look at yeah i think what it is we've it's actually going to come up here into it so if we can try and get it to there uh see if i can sort it out like i said i might have to put some beams at the bottom there to hide the wires uh, to do it that way now we've got uh, let's have a look at where those uh cables are see so we've got all the cables that are coming through there this is kind of hidden at the moment so i think we've got the power cable coming up here aren't we which is going across there then so yeah there we go so that's what i thought so if we can if we take this out then let me just make sure I'm taking the right thing out first. Is that where the cable is? Hold on a minute, where's the cable? Uh, or is it on that side? I thought I had it on one side. I know I had it coming this way, but unless that's going up, I haven't decided to put it up yet. Right, okay, let's uh, let's just uh, take this out and have a look. Yeah, there's the cable. There's the cable, but we're going to have to take all this out first so I can see where it connects to. So that's going to have to go up there, isn't it? So what we can do then is if I actually put... Right, if I get a cable going from here, oh, let me back onto there. That's, that's good enough. You take that all the way to there. there we go, we'll come off that. And then if we grab, I'll just do it from there. To there. There we go. And then if we can get that there. And then if we go upstairs, we can see where that's actually going to line up. And where does that line up? That actually lines up to here, look. Okay. So we are going to need to sort of... I need to work out where the kitchen's going to be. But if we can get this power in... Uh, but like I say, I think we're going to need to have beams going across here. And uh, yeah, if we have beams going across here, uh, just to hide the cable in, uh, that's going to be our best bet. I mean, for now, what I'll do, I'll just use the normal beams that we've got. So can I take that out? I can. So if I get that to there a lot. There we go. So if we get that to there. And we've got that sorted. So I'm going to go and grab some beams real quick. Uh, what I'm probably going to do is I'm going to have some beams going across here as well. Because what we're going to, what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring it up here, 
I'm literally going to bring it all the way around. Uh, and the reason for that is... Oh, hold on a minute. I'm going to have to bring it over these doors. I don't really want the beams in the doors. Right, let's just go and get the beams a minute. And work this out. I've also got to do this with the actual other cable as well. Um, just realised I haven't got my headset on fully. <laughs> I wondered why it was sounding a bit weird. Uh, so let's grab some beams. Fine for now. We can always grab some more if we need to. Is my light not on? Oh, I must have switched it off. Uh, let's grab this one, actually. I need to get a second one of these done. Just a lot better light. I, need to, I might get a few of those done and get some more of the, um, the charging stations going. Okay, so, oh, what I need to do is get the cabling sorted out first. So we need to get the cabling from there. Oh, no, I actually did. I did do it, didn't I? I did actually do it. I hope that's actually connected correctly. Uh, I might have to just test that out uh, by um, placing something here. Have I got anything I could do with that, though? Right, okay. Anyway, so I think what I might have to do is I might have to put beams. Yeah, I might have to put beams going across here, uh, going across there so we can hide the wires, at least on this bit here, because this is where, well, actually, we're going to have power up the top there as well. Yeah, we're going to have power at the top there as well. Right, let's just start... Um, Let's just start um, bringing this over. Bring that to there, lot. Uh, I'm going to take that out. I'm going to put that there. And then connect that to there. And then we want that here. Went all the way to there. You kind of go back. Actually, I think. Uh, yeah, yeah, this is actually working the way I thought it would work. And that to there. That to there. That is a lot better. And then there. To there. That is a lot better. Thank you guys. I appreciate the suggestion of that. That actually works really, really well. That to there. That to there. Okay. And what we can do if we do, because we will probably do lighting and that in there as well, is we'll, we'll sort that out afterwards. I will actually place that back there. And as you can see, that's hidden that. Uh, that doesn't look too bad. What we could do is to actually make sure. I've just realized something. We could leave those cables like that, but just make sure that these are all sort of like covered here. Uh, so instead of having the actual cable, having the beams going across there, which means I would have to redo that. So if we took this out then, and then if we actually take this off, so if I just, uh, right, I'm going to have to take that back out again. So if we do that there, look. Right, I'm just going to have to redo this. For now there we go so we do that and if we put that right there where the beam's going to be going up there we go and there we might not even need to put the beams at the bottom there i mean i might still do the beams but i mean we'll just see how this goes there we go and we just got to get it in the right position and then bring it down that really does work a lot better. And it's a lot easier as well doing it this way. So you're kind of going back on yourself, aren't you? I just hope that's connected. Um, I need something to test out with that first. And make sure the power is connected before we do anything else. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring over the, the charging station for now. Is there anything else? Yeah, that needs biofuel on it, doesn't it? Yeah, let's just bring this over. 
can always re reset that. I just want to see whether this will actually power up. I just want to make sure it's connected properly before we continue. It's always a safe bet to do that, to be honest. So I'm just going to put that there. If we do that, look. And that's powered up, so that's all I wanted to know. Okay, cool. So we can set that back downstairs. I just wanted to make sure that was connection. I was a bit worried, because sometimes it doesn't always connect properly. So zero. Go. What, I'd already done this one here. Obviously not. I'm going to go ahead and put that in there. And then here. To there. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, and then what we need to do is we need to take this one out. We need to take all of these out, actually, just here. And what we're going to do, we're going to wire this all the way around so that we've all, so we've got the cables everywhere. That we, and then we can actually connect things up wherever we need to. There we go. And then bring this down from here. Perfect. And we just need to make sure we actually get that actual connection bit there so that we can actually hide it. There we go. Let me put the beam there so we know that's going to be fine. And I think this is probably the better way to do it. I know it's going to take a while, but this is probably the better way to do it, to just have it going all the way around and then later on when you do add, actually add everything. It's just a lot easier. You just take the beams out and see where the connection is, and off you go. Bob your uncle. Okay, uh, let's have a look at where I want to put that. I'm going to go right there. And then there. There we go. And then again, we're going to come up this way. And before I continue with that, I want to start putting down the actual beams back. So I'm not, should I do that one? Yeah, we'll do that one. But as you can see there now, we've only got that wire going across there. And that actually looks pretty nice without those connections there, which is really, really good in fact. Uh, how far did we go with the wire in there? We went all the way to there, didn't we? Okay, so we can actually put those back in then. Now, these, like I say, well, I've not tested out what beams I'm going to be using for this yet, but for now, this will do. Uh, and then we'll work that out afterwards. In fact, do I really need beams going around there as well? I mean, we could have beams going around there to hide all of that there. Uh, so what we could do is we could do that going around there. And there we go. And then maybe put one going up there. Maybe. Yeah, the problem is we've got that there now. Okay, yeah, do you know what? I'm fine with that for now. We'll look at that next time. But like I said, I just want to get the wiring sorted out before anything else. So we need to continue around here and then I can get the beams in here. I don't know whether I want those beams like that though. Kind of wish they went flush more so it's more square rather than like this. But I mean, what are you going to do? <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, have I got any food? I haven't got any food on me. Uh, right, okay. So where did we get to? So we got to there. So what we need to do is put that there. I'm sure we could probably reach all the way from here, but I think I'm going to do it like this. This is definitely a better way of doing it. Definitely easier. Okay. Okay, so I think that's as far as I'm going to go with that for now. Uh, I need to work out the water one as well. Uh, now, oh, I put all the beams back though, didn't I? Right, let's see where the water one finishes. And then I'll do a lot of this off screen because obviously it's going to be tedious. Well, it's not as tedious as it was before, but uh, there's a lot to it. And yeah, let's have a look at where the water pipes are where we need to put those. 
So I believe those are on this side. So if we take that out. Yeah, there we go, look. So if we take that out, there we go. And then what we need to do is we need to put that. No. Yeah, that's the right one, isn't it? And then we connect that to that. There we go. And then we connect to that one. There. And then we just come up the top there. And then we can get this set up. Has one of those beams come off? Oh. Yeah, it has. There was a beam there. Right, okay, so this actually... Oh, God, you've got to be kidding me. This actually comes up to here. So we're going to have to move this over. In fact, I think I'm going to... Tr yeah, that's not good. So we're going to need to move that over one. Okay, that's fine. We can do that. It's not a big deal. So we're going to have to move that over one. So that's where this one is. So we can either move it that way or that way. Although I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to move it that way and we'll have it going around that way. Yeah, that's fine. So if we take that out there. And then we connect this up here. Oh, hold on a minute. No, no, we don't. We connect that up there first. Because we go back on ourselves. There we go. And connect that to there. There we go. And then we get those straight lines. That's perfect. So, and then we can do that. And then we should be able to get that up. <laughs> That's what she said. Okay, so that will bring this up to here, look. So if we take this out now. And then we can literally place that there. The problem is the water pipe. It's not going to look that great there compared to that. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to have the water pipe. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's see what it looks like first. I might end up just doing the beams, you know. As long as it's not on the doors. So if we bring that back, look. And have a look at that. I forgot to eat. Yeah, no, I don't want those there. So I think I'm going to do my other plan, so I might have to redo those. So what we'll do is we'll come up. Yeah, I think we're just going to have to have the beans going across there, to be honest with you, because I want to keep that there. Although what we could do is have beams going on the top here, going across there, split it up, and then have that going up to here. And then that can come across here then, and then along here. And then we'll just bring it down as we need it from there. Okay, we'll do it that way then. Yeah, we'll do it that way. So what we need to do then is this. This. Okay, and then we just need to bring that from here here and the same here so we're going to have to take that one out put that there to there and just keep doing that and then what i'll do i'll uh, off screen i'll go ahead and i'll just wire this all up the way i'm doing it uh, and then hopefully in the next video we'll sort out the kitchen and get that all set up uh, ready to go and uh, we should be good then. And we can even get the bed up here and just sleep in the kitchen for a little bit until we've sorted it all out. Uh, there we go. So let's have a look at the way we're going to do this now. Right, I'm going to have to go and quickly eat first. This is why I want everything up here because like, if I got the freezer up here with all the food and that, then I don't have to keep running down to do it. That was always going to be a temporary thing down the bottom there, like a little workshop, like a little cabin just to get started. Plus, I need to get to sleep as well. So, yeah, there is that. Okay. I don't know if I told you, actually. Um, I think I know why there's no stamina. Uh, I think it was because I was using, before, I was using uh, cream corn and fruit salad and that, and that's where I was getting the stamina from. I've just remembered when I was looking at it earlier. Okay, so let's have a quick look at the... Um, at the beams and that. Where we're going to do this and then i'm going to have to replace everything in there let's have a look 
Okay, so we've got that there. So if we go ahead and replace these now. I mean, e even if we don't put beams here, although we probably will have to anyway now, think, looking at it. Yeah. But then if we actually do these beams going across here as well, I'm fine with doing that. And then we'll also do that on the door going across here like so and that will hide all of the cables so what i'll do i'll probably do that the same with these as well bring this up and then just bring it going across here and then around there and i think that will work anyway guys i am going to call it here thank you so much for joining me take care and i'll see you in the next one Beautiful.